plants are all around us. We can grow them in our homes, we can buy them from a store, and of course, we can see them all around outside. Today, we're going to find out more about what each of the different plant parts does. We'll find out about roots, stems, leaves, and flowers. Did you know that we eat all of the parts of a plant? We do. We eat roots, stems, leaves, and flowers. Let's first see what roots do to help their plants live. The roots of a plant act like straws by absorbing water and minerals from the soil that surrounds the plant. Tiny root hairs stick out of the root to help with absorbing water and minerals. Roots help to anchor the plant in the soil so it does not fall over. Roots also store extra food for later in case the plant needs it. How do stems help their plants live? Stems do many things. One thing stems do is support the plant and hold it upright. Stems also act like the plant's plumbing system, moving water and nutrients from the roots and food from the leaves to other plant parts. Stems can be soft and bendable like the stem of a daisy or woody like the trunk of a tree. Let's find out what leaves do for their plants. Most plants make food in their leaves. Leaves are designed to capture sunlight, which the plant uses to make food through a process called photosynthesis. This is when the plant uses energy from the sunlight, carbon dioxide from the air, and water and nutrients from the soil to make food. Finally, let's find out more about flowers. Flowers are the reproductive part of most plants. Flowers attract pollinators like bees to move pollen from one plant to another. Pollination is needed for seeds to form in flowering plants. That is how the different parts of the plant work together.